I definitely have taken my lungs for granted. I'm not a smoker. I, you know, take fairly good care of myself. I, and I don't have cancer in my family. Lung cancer was not even on my radar. In February of 2021, I thought I was fine. And I suddenly found out I wasn't fine. My doctor called and said, I don't like the looks of this CT scan. He said, I'm seeing a mass in your lung. And he said, I'm not wasting any time. I want to get you into the multi-specialty team at Spectrum right away. And I just, I thought, what am I going to tell my kids? You know, they've already left, lost their dad at 54. And, you know, all those things go through your mind and you think the worst, right? Like, oh my gosh. The first time that I saw Deb, I was very humbled by her questions and her willingness to work with me in order to perform a minimally invasive test in a very difficult area. I was able to get very far in the left lung. I was able to see what I was doing. And while directly visualizing the areas, I was able to make micro adjustments. So leveraging the control features of the Monarch, I was able to sample abundantly that area. We were able to find a very, very small area of what could have proven to be a very lethal cancer. And he said, I have difficult news for you, but in a way it's the best possible news. He said, you do have cancer, which, you know, you've been preparing yourself for, but there's something about hearing that and having it confirmed that is very sobering. It's very challenging for patients to come see doctors with unknowns, and I hope that I can be one of the doctors that kind of turns things for the better. Unfortunately, cancer is one of those conditions that relentlessly grows. And this is really funny to me when I think about it now, but it was like, I get to have a lobectomy. And I don't know that that ever would have been something I would rejoice about before. <laughs> I am aware from the people on the lung specialty team saying many times we see people with advanced lung cancer because it, it doesn't really have a lot of symptoms attached to it. And you're one of the fortunate ones. I took advantage of every single feature that Monarch had to offer. And this was pretty amazing outcome on somebody that trusted us, trusted our skills, trusted our equipment, and she'll live a normal life. My experience was incredibly positive from beginning to end. But you know how it feels to take a deep breath all the way in and feel like you got all the way to the bottom of it? I could do that. I could do that. Since the surgery, I am aware every single day that life is a gift and that breath is a gift.